Good morning, it's Jonathan with Scenic City Heating and AC. And this morning we are putting a new system in a basement. A beautiful home out here in the Appleson, McDonald area. And I'm gonna show you a little bit about how it's going in. So the air handler's gonna be back here in a very nice encapsulated crawl space. We don't often get to work in crawl spaces this nice. Uh, we're gonna have the air handler here. Maybe a little closer to the wall, hanging. It'll have trunk for a supply go through there, and we're not going to hole in return for return there. That will go underneath the stairwell. On the outside, we're going to put a condenser here, which is uh, going to be a challenge to get the line set to because that's garage, and over here is our crawl space. So we're going to have to come out knock a hole underneath that deck um, through the block wall and run the line set over there. We're gonna wait because the customer wants to put a concrete pad there first. So it'll probably be about a week before we get that done. Make a little bit of mess down here. Move the furniture out of the way. So this is where our supply is going to come through. We keep it nice, high, and tight. Have all of our takeoffs or branch lines up in the bay, and they're going to sheetrock it. So we want to have as little box out as possible. We we'll go above that door and feed branches. We we'll go both directions of our branch lines. So I got measurements and I've been back at the shop making the duct work for a few hours and I'll show you what I've got. First is a piece to transfer from a 12 by 16 to an 8 by 14. That will go on the unit end right there. And then this will be a duct work short piece through the wall, the block wall. Then we'll offset up about an inch and a half to be high and tight to the uh, floor joist above. We'll run some 8x14 and then we'll reduce down to 8x10, run a little bit of 8x10 and have a head at the other end. All right, we are at the end of kind of day two, day one and a half um, on this project. Just wanted to show you what we've got done. Um, that's where the trunk comes through. We've got an inch and a half offset up. Um, we've got top takeoffs going out here and then there. Kind of see that don't go the way. We reduce down to uh, eight by ten instead of eight by fourteen. Going through here and have some more top takeoffs. So got the trunk done. Um, guys beat on this wall for quite a while trying to get it opened up. I think we're about where we need to be to get returned through there. This is the back side of the uh, transition from the unit to the 8x14 and we've got an 8 inch takeoff on the bottom there. It's going to come through to feed out this room.